Hello guys, in this video, I'm just going to explain how to fix this hardware virtualization must be turned on. For example, if you are installing some apps on your Windows PC like Google Play Games, so you might be getting this error, okay? In order to install, right, I need to enable this hardware virtualization. So how to check that hardware virtualization is already enabled or not in my PC? So for that, right, uh, in Windows PC, just go to taskbar and right click and open this task manager, okay? And so here click on this hamburger menu and then go to this performance. Okay. And then click on CPU. And then here right side you can check virtualization is disabled. See, it's a disabled. So now I'm going to enable it. For that, you need to restart your PC in BIOS mode. Okay. So you need to check the firmware settings actually. So close all the apps and then go to settings. Go to settings under setting right click on the system and here choose recovery click on this recovery and then under advanced startup right you need to click on this restart now okay so here i'm going to click on this restart now yes I think it's going to bias mode. Yes. Now you need to click on this troubleshoot. Click on the troubleshoot and then go to advanced options. And here, right, you need to click on this UEFI firmware settings. So click on that. So I'm going to restart it. So that's it, friends. Now you can see this bias settings here. So here actually we need to go to this overclocking settings, okay? Overclocking, okay. Click on this overclocking settings and uh, come to this CPU features. Okay, and uh, here you can see this SVM mode. So by default, it is disabled. I need to enable it. Uh, before that, I just want to show the shortcut if you're not able to find it, okay? And here you can search actually. So here type uh, SVM mode. If you're using AMD motherboard, then you need to type SVM. If it is a Intel motherboard, you need to search Intel. Okay. So SVM motherboard. So it's enabled. Uh, sorry, it's a disabled. I'm going to enable it. So type SVM. Enabled. That's a friends. Now I should not be getting any error if I'm trying to install any games in Google Play. Okay, fine. So you need to basically search on overclocking settings and here come to features, CPU features, and then click on this SVM mode and enable it. So that's a friends. So once done, right, you need to save it actually. So settings is done. And then I need to press F10 to save it. In the keyboard, save configuration and exit. Yes, I'm going to give that. After enabling virtualization on in the BIOS settings, I'm going to verify in task manager. Right click task manager and then uh, click on the hamburger menu and go to performance and then click on CPU. Now you can see this virtualization is enabled. Okay, that's good. Now I'm going to open the Google Play. Google Play games data. Cool. It should be in my library. I'm trying to install any of the games. Okay. So now I'm going to install it. Yes, yeah, super cool. Now I'm going to add it to the shortcut. That's it friends, this is the way you can enable virtualizations on your 